When we first heard the news, we were in shock. My husband has always been someone who loves life, who likes being active, who enjoys his work. And now he's being told to get his affairs in order. The doctor told us that Marcus had Alzheimer's disease. She told us that it had progressed a lot further than she expected. She told him to get ready, to leave his job, and retire permanently. We, we weren't ready to hear that, and we decided, no, no, we weren't going to accept that either. So we gave the situation to God. What really helped was listening to Pastor Prince's sermons, and especially the ones about the Holy Communion. So we began to take the communion together at home, and we took it often. It didn't happen immediately, but we really believe that that, that was the turning point. Four and a half years later, my husband went for another MRI, and that's when we saw. We saw our miracle. Till today, I remember the look on the doctor's face. She was so confused. She stared at the scan, and then she stared at us, and finally she said, I'm looking at a healthy brain. There's no sign of Alzheimer's disease here. So there was nothing left for her to do but to remove the diagnosis. I'm so, just so grateful to the Lord for his healing, and I am so, so happy to have my husband back. We believe that there are many, many more good years ahead for us. What an amazing testimony from Marcus. Alzheimer's disease is one of the leading causes of death in America and has no known cure. What is worse is that it slowly robs people of their relationships with their loved ones. But thank God there is no incurable disease that is beyond His healing power. I love how Marcus and his wife Kathy did not just accept the diagnosis, but chose to fill themselves with scriptures, listen to the preach word, and take the Holy Communion on a regular basis. Every time they partook of the bread and the cup, divine healing was being released into Marcus' mind until he was completely healed. This is just one of many real stories of people who have experienced the healing power of the Holy Communion. My friend, if you are facing a challenge in your health today, will you partake of the communion like Marcus did? I am believing with you that what God did for him, he can also do for you. <laughs>